If you don't mind, I've got a Kenny King crisis to deal with. Just a minute there, Jackson. I know you all have been working hard, but there's just one little problem. What's that? You haven't even decorated the command center yet. Where's all the tinsel? Where's the lights? Where's the tree? We've been waiting for you. After all, there's no more terrific tree trimmer than Christmas Crusader. Oh, stop. You're embarrassing me. Bring those boxes out of storage, kids. It's time to decorate. Right. Let's deck the halls, everyone.
You got it, Super Dude. Christmas is about presents, and Santa is the man with the presents. Well, you're right. The most important thing about Christmas is presents. What? Crusader, you can't be serious. Sure I am. Christmas is all about a very special present. But it's not a present from Santa Claus, or your parents, or even your Aunt Matilda. It's about a present from God. That's right. Jesus was the first Christmas present. God's present to us. Yeah. You dudes are confusing me here. Just listen to this and you might understand. This is what Christmas means to me. Does Christmas really mean all those things? All those things are a part of Christmas, but the real reason for Christmas is God's gift to us. It's his son, Jesus Christ. He was born as a baby in a manger. So Christmas is really a birthday celebration for Jesus. But what about things like stockings, and tinsel, and lights, and candy canes, and gifts, and Santa Claus? There's still room for all those things. Those are all fun parts of Christmas, but we can't let them distract us from the real reason for Christmas. A lot of people celebrate Christmas, but forget to celebrate the birth of Jesus. How would you feel if everybody knew it was your birthday, but ignored it? That would be a real bummer. God gave us his son, Jesus. He was born in a manger. He lived a perfect life. He 
he never sinned. Yet he paid the price for our sins by dying on the cross and coming back to life three days later. So that one day we could be with God in heaven. Man, that sounds like the best gift ever. Better than anything the old Santa dude could bring. You got that right? Now you just need one more gift. Another gift? There's always room under my tree for one more present. What is it? A new heart. A new heart? It's not Valentine's Day yet, Crusader Man. It's Christmas. When we accept God's gift of salvation, he'll give us a new heart. One that is clean from sin. Come on, kids. Let's show him. There are lots of things you want when Christmas rolls around. Lots of things are on your Christmas list. But won't you save a space when you write them down? And when you do, won't you remember this? You need a new heart for Christmas, a new start for Christmas, a new way. Jesus makes Christmas super! 